And Saint Germain had the chance on Friday night to stretch the lead at the top of Ligue 1 Conferama at home to Saint Etienne. It's been a perfect start so far for new coach Thomas Tuchel, and a fifth win would see the champions 11 points clear, provisionally at least, of last season's runner up Monaco after just five games. Saint Etienne, though, with the only other unbeaten side in the league, and hope to catch PSG off guard with the Champions League restarting in midweek. Tuchel trusting his hugely talented squad, leaving Neymar in the stands with Kylian Mbappe obviously suspended after his red card against Nîmes. This all ahead of the mouth-watering tie with Liverpool on Tuesday night. Edison Cavani was flanked in a front three with Julian Draxler and Angel Di Maria tasked with opening up Le Ver, and it was the latter who set up the former, only for Stefan Ruffier to push the Germans' effort wide. Well, Saint-Étienne were sterner stuff in the first half and almost found themselves ahead. Unable, though, to hit the target from Gomez's strike. Well, some stars missing, but one returning. Marco Verratti finding Julian Draxler. Header tennis opening the account for the season for Draxler. His fellow German on the PSG bench delighted. Verratti back for his first appearance since the Trophy de Champion victory over Monaco in August with a stunning assist. The left foot clip, finding the head of Draxler. The earliest he scored for Paris Saint-Germain, adding to his eight previous Liga and Conferama goals. 1-0 at the break, but PSG not really stretching Saint-Étienne enough. Tuchel then looking to his bench, deciding he didn't need as much defensive cover. Hassana Diara was sacrificed and on came Musa Diaby plenty of instructions as he made his third substitute appearance of the season well Jean-Louis Gasset never one to look too cheery didn't look too confident that his Lever side would come back against the club he served as an assistant to Laurent Blanc he certainly wouldn't have been smiling when Enes Cavani was felled by Loic Perrin Parent tried to lead complaints, but clearly catching the Uruguayan. And Cavani, since returning from injury, has scored in each match he's played. That made it 3-3 three three for El Matador. A 16th Liga and Conferama penalty from 119 league goals. Neymar and Mbappe looking relaxed and cheerful as they watch one third of MCN do the business. One concern ahead of the trip to Anfield in four days' time would be the injury to Thiago Silva. Clashing with Luis Dione. Brazilian certainly looked in a lot of pain. He was substituted for Tilo Kerrer. Tuchel later said the captain would be fine for the trip to Liverpool. Well, Munier missed his header, but it ran perfectly for Diaby. Eventually find his way to Di Maria. And a stunning lifted finish over Ruffier. Well, the earliest the Argentine had previously scored was week seven, but now two in his first five. The front three of MCD, making up for the lack of two thirds of MCN. And there was still time for Musa Diaby to get his name on the score sheet for the first time in the top flight. Clinical finish, only the second time PSG have ever won their opening five matches. The other was last year, and in Unai Emery's last season, they won six. Tuchel will certainly hope his star-studded squad could beat that record. Tuchel has his own piece of history, the first PSG coach to win his first five Ligue 1 Conferama matches with the club in his debut season. Paris go to Anfield full of confidence with Neymar and Mbappe to return in the Champions League blockbuster. Not worth missing.